Hi guys, it's Colette. Welcome back to my channel. And uh, today I want to do some more mediumship. Um, I felt the last one I did, um, there was more that could come through, but I was actually really tired. So um, the channel's open now, White Storm's here. Thank you. And uh, we'll just see what we get. Um, and I hope you can take some of the messages and if you can and you know who they're for, please pass them on, but do so in a delicate way and choose your time, okay? <sighs> right, I have a message from a George in spirit and it's for a Gordon here. I think Gordon's a son or a grandson. Uh, and I don't think George got to say what he wanted to Gordon before he passed and I'm not sure, the way he's putting it, I'm not sure if he had things he wanted to say emotionally or that he was very confused and he didn't get the chance to say um, so I'm, I'm not sure about that one but um, George is there uh, very bright and happy now. I thought he said he'd met up with Amy. It could be Amy, it could be Amy M. Um, but he's a happy spirit. And Gordon definitely. Um, I think Gordon has his glasses. Okay, thank you. Uh, We've got a, it's a female, but she said her nickname was Bean. Bean. Um, I have no idea why, but she's saying she was called Bean. Um, term of endearment nickname. And she would like to say hello to Matthew and Derek, I think. And just let people know that she's okay. Well, she's more than okay. Um, there's a Margaret with her. And that name's really important, actually. I don't know if maybe the Bean is Margaret as well. But um, she definitely had the nickname Bean or something to do with that. Thank you. Uh, I've got a Jessica who um, says she was found one morning. Um, but it wasn't a hard pass on. She was fine and the family have not to worry about her. Her passing was actually easier than they may imagine. That's Jessica. I've got a... I'm not sure if this is about the Jessica, but she's putting a little toy forward to someone and I don't know if she's saying that they've got this toy or maybe it was associated with her but it's a kind of purple toy like a stuffed toy from a cartoon I think I've seen it before it's purpley violet fur maybe a mix between a bear and something I'm not quite sure what this is but I know it's a, a known toy um, it's like, you know, a Muppet would have been, but it seems more modern than that. So this is, it's purpley lilac, furry, well, furry wooly. Um, and she's shown this toy, this, uh, thing. She's saying someone will know, someone will take it. Thank you. Um, I've got Penelope who has met up with another Penelope in spirit, like a great aunt or something that they shared the name. Um, and she has a message for John and the family who are still here in that. Um, I think that family has maybe lost a lot of babies or had miscarriages and she's saying that the, the babies are fine. The babies are fine. Now, I shouldn't have said that. I shouldn't have put more an opinion on that. Thanks, White Storm. Getting told off the White Storm. The sense I got was 
um, that there were babies in spirit and then she said the babies are fine. I said from my opinion that maybe this family had lost lots of babies or had miscarriages and White Storm was like, stop. Bat's been told, that's not my job. Say what you're told or really, really know that's coming from the spirit. Don't add your own bits to it. That's the difference between mediumship and mediumship that meanders into sometimes imagination. And White Storm's, White Storm's always agreed to tell me off for that if I do it because I really don't like that type of mediumship and uh, I like to be precise. So right from the start, I was always like, I want to be precise. I don't want to meander into a story unless the story is coming from the spirit and he was like, right. And every so often, because I'm human, I sort of try and interpret it myself. And he's like, wait, nope. And I thank you for that, White Storm. Okay, nothing like being 60 and being told off, is there? <laughs> but seriously, if you have mediumistic qualities and you want to be a good medium, um, keep yourself very strong in what you're actually getting as opposed to what you might be potentially wanting to add on yourself. Um, please, because that's what makes the, what you're doing is just maybe a guess or it's something that you would think you would know. And the proof is that whether I'm right or not with that, White Stone's not saying, he's just saying, you shouldn't have said that, you should have just let the message be presented. So thank you. Um, I've got a Teresa who wants to let the family know that she's met Jean. Um, she's met Lucy, maybe? Luke. Lucy, Luke, name. And then, um, again, she's happy in spirit. Uh, I've got a man that I believe shown me a, a car tumbling over or crashing. Um, he's saying Vancouver. Um, and again I'm not going to say is he from Vancouver was the accident in Vancouver he's just saying Vancouver and um, he was glad that um, he was the one that took the force of things it's, a, it's a, an intense thing to say uh, he's connected with the name Fraser And he's just saying it again, he's glad that he took the force of things. Thank you. And I've got someone in spirit wishing, um, I think it might be Julie. Julie, Julie, Julie. A uh, happy 90th birthday. Um, she's been very precise with the 90th. Um, it could be Julie or Jilly. Could be Jelly as well. <laughs> Sorry. Um, and there's lots of cards with roses, and there's cake should have roses on it too. Again, the the connection I believe is rose or roses. Being cryptic now with a lot of you. Hmm. Anyway, right folks. <laughs> that was a mad one. But um, that'll do for now. And I'll sort of jump back whenever I feel enough to do it. And um, we'll keep it that way and hopefully. I mean, if you really like the mediumship, let me know. I know it's quite a popular thing. And I've had a lot of people saying they would like it more than once, twice a month. Um, let me know if that's important to you. Um, if it's Maybe if it's why you come to the channel. Because you know we do a lot of things. But I'd like to, those that people that particularly come and subscribe and stay with the channel, I'd like to know why you're here. Um, 
you know, what sort of content do you like? Um, or is it just that we're a good wee family now and we chat in the comments? <laughs> Who knows? Um, I come to the channel because I really enjoy chatting to you all and I also enjoy passing on any teachings that I've learned and this life of mine which seems to have squished about 500 years into 60. Um, it's been quite a dynamic, um, intense life of learning and doing things that I never thought I would. So, um, yeah, if I can pass that on, then I'm happy with that. But I do like the chats as well. Uh, so anyway, um, thumbs up. If you want to support the channel, there's details in the description below how you can do that. And um, have a nice uh, wee time till we do this again. Many blessings now. Bye.